like I said, coming in off a nice streak. He looked really sharp in his last fight, but heard big things about Roberson. Yeah, he yeah. has a beat. He's very explosive. Southpaw, always tricky. Big, big left kick early. Mike's going to want to try to use his hands to set up his takedowns. This kid's really tough. Uh, you know, James passed cross pass with a guy of the name of Chiki Obi. He has a win over him. As nice Wilcox defense. looks to throw the overhand right, maybe get the takedown. And, He's uh, going to have to set it up more than that. He can't just dive in like that. Wow, he's going for that head kick. He's got to set that up, though, with his hands. And that south, Mike's got to be careful. That southpaw stance, and it does lead up to that kick. But nice job there by Wilcox to close the distance. Robertson showing that he's got some strength in takedown defense as well as some kicks. Nice job there, but Wilcox himself closing the distance here. Yep. Going reckless abandon. He yeah, wants this fight on the, the ground. Takedown. He's slipping a little bit, but he's got it anyway. Now Mike's nice. got to take his time, in my uh, opinion. Mike Wilcox, nice job of getting the takedown. Paul Felder mentioned he should take his time, get in his dominant yeah. position, cage press a little bit. Nice you know, elbow by him Wilcox. Down. Yeah, you don't want to rush this, you know, and, and lose position or gas yourself out. Mike's got him down. He's got him where he wants him. He needs to take his time and find those elbows. And for Robertson, he's going to use his cage just like he's using now. Get a wizard and try to pop back up. And he's definitely got it. He does not want to stay underneath what is a very powerful and, and, and fantastic submission wrestler in jiu-jitsu game Yeah, with Mike you gotta Wilcox. watch your neck with Wilcox. If you leave it there like that, he will find it and he will choke you out. Man, I'd be, I would be shocked if he got the tap. His, his one arm is, is up. I'm not sure if that's something he's considering doing. He's Looking getting his, some instructions. His corner's right here. I don't know what they're telling him, but he, he's out of it now. Looked like Daniel Gracie was telling him to maybe step around potentially and yeah, and you, again, it's out, early in the fight. You don't want to, you know, blow your arms out or this early, especially with a tough guy like Robertson. You, you could be in there a while, and when he's throwing head kicks like that, you want your arms up. Yeah, highly touted, this young man. He's got he's, a Kimura wow, here. Nicely got a I Kimura. didn't see that coming. Mike trying to throw up a triangle to no avail. That Robertson fights that off well, ends up on top. Great transitions here as we are in Carl Robertson versus Mike Wilcox. Roberson was undefeated through his amateur. He does describe himself as a striker, yeah. but he is doing very well on the ground as he looks to pass the guard and now move in the mount. Wow, good job by Roberson. He's right on top now. He's got Mike pressed against the fence. He's gonna, Mike grabbing the cage there. He's gotta be careful he doesn't get a point taken away for that. Can't remember the last time I saw Wilcox get on mounted his back, by anybody mounted. on his back, so. Yeah, this kid's no joke, huh? Got a cage walk here. That would be a nice idea. Mike's out for a second. Got to nice watch shot. his arm in the triangle. He's caught an arm bar. No, That's that on. Arm tight. That is tight. This Mike's is deep. Got a this is trouble. That's the tap. Out. That's the tap. Nice finish there. Great job by Roberson. Carl wow. Roberson, first round submission arm bar as advertised. This is one tough kid, man. So, uh, Taking a look at it, Paul Felder. Yeah, he tried to fight this mount, and he kind of just got a little reckless with it to get out, and he got his arm trapped in there. You know what? That was just a mistake made by Mike. He, he got out of that mount, and he left his arm hanging out in there to throw a punch. you got to get your arms out of between the legs of a guy, man, or you're going to get tapped. Roberson did a really nice great, job great of job. Uh, keep, uh, keeping his hips and keeping his pressure on that arm so it wouldn't slip out. So nice yeah. job there by Carl Roberson. He's your victor in quick fashion. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout was stopped at three minutes and 11 seconds in the first round. Winner by submission by way of the arm bar, out of the blue corner, Carl Baby K. Robertson. Okay, folks, we're gonna have an interview with your victor. Carl Roberson is gonna have an interview with Paul Felder. Carl, great job, man. Now, you know, you came in here, everybody's saying kickboxer, you label yourself as a kickboxer. But what I was impressed with was your jujitsu and your scrambles. Is that something, you know, facing somebody like the Cowboy, something that you guys worked on on a daily basis? Definitely, definitely. Uh, that was one of my weaker aspects is uh, jujitsu. My coach and my brother, uh, Corey Anderson, with the wrestling. It's kind of keep pressure and kind of keep the legs in, in play. And it'll work tonight. Yeah, man, you look great. You know, you, uh, you, you transitioned, you, you know, you got the scramble, and Mike kind of left his arm in there, and you just snatched it up and got the finish, you know. Congratulations, man. Anything you want to say? Nah, just thank you to everybody who's supporting me. 
And shout out, because I'm coming hard for everybody. Come on. Congratulations, brother. Good job, man.